Hello, we're here at CS Presents. Uh, it's the last uh, CS Presents of, of 2013 and I thought we'd take the opportunity to grab one of the CS Presents organisers and get him on the couch. Hi, how are you? I'm very well. Uh, well, what's your name? What, what are you up to? Um, my name's Daniel E. Fiendarka. I'm the Head of Innovation at Chair Worldwide. I just happen to be one of the founders of Creative Social as well. I don't actually organise the events, I just turn up. It was your idea? Sort of, yes. Well, I mean, absolutely love coming to these events. Everyone is, what I always say about it is, it's as, it's as fun as it is controversial and always, always great speakers. I think the great thing is you never know what they're going to talk about. I mean, I think tonight we've got fan five fantastic speakers and uh, we have a topic, Can You Hack It? But how they take that topic is going to be totally up to them. So I think it's as much the surprise. Uh, I know we do have notes in terms of the website. I don't even look at those. I kind of want to come in come quite fresh and just hear five great speakers talk about one subject. Yeah, and it's uh, five ladies tonight, isn't it? It is five ladies, yeah. We, we kind of made a... Um, we know the she, she Says crew really well um, and we've been working with them to work out how we can get better representation of uh, women within the industry and we thought this was just a nice way of doing it, um, just getting five female speakers. And uh, you just touched on there about the industry and, and creative social. Can you say something about like, what, is, what is the heart for you guys about supporting the industry? Why did you do this? Um, we do it because one, we, we have global events that we do every six months that um, us senior people get inspired by and uh, after doing that for nine years or certainly doing that for seven years, three years ago we kind of decided we wanted to get uh, a different audience and give them the same inspiration we got and hopefully this is our, our little way of giving back and giving a bit more inspiration. And uh, like I said, it's the last event of the year, have you got some highlights for yourself from 2013, Any, anything really stand out? Um, I, think, I think the highlight's been that we've got through the year and had four events um, supported by Source, which has been fantastic. Uh, we had, I mean, it was great to have CS Inspire again this year, um, have a half a day of people coming in and being inspired. Uh, and I think the team's done a fantastic job. As I say, I don't organise it. Uh, I just want to say a big shout out to El and James and Anna for all your hard work. I think they've done an absolutely brilliant job. Uh, well, I completely agree with that. Um, 2014, what, what's, what's going to happen? What, what can we look forward to? Um, I think. Much of the same. Uh, we'll carry on with the CS Presents events. We'll probably mix it up. Um, I think part of what we do is experimentation, try some stuff, see if it works, see if it doesn't work. Um, I think uh, you know it's our Creative Social's 10th year, and I think in your 10th year you probably need to change things slightly. Uh, and I think we'll see some interesting changes next year for Creative Social. Uh, so it'll be something to look forward to. Yeah. And I guess just finally, uh, for someone who's watching this, this video and hasn't been to one of your events before, I come into them, I really don't feel like I'm sat at someone's event. It's just, it's, I get so much from it. What would you say to someone watching this video if they're thinking about coming to a, a creative social event? Come. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's just it. Just stop it, I come. I don't, listen, I, think, I don't think you, can, you can't bottle it. I mean, you really need to come. And, um, and it, is for, it is attended for all age groups. Although we initially looked at going to mid-creative and lower creative, what you're getting is more... Uh, senior creative directors and the socials themselves coming here because the speakers we get are fantastic and it's very industry focused uh, and it's you know an hour and a half and uh, a couple of beers and um, it's a good place to network as well so I think my if you haven't been come along and try it Brilliant. and if you don't like it come and speak to me and I'll give you your money back <laughs> awesome uh, Twitter blogs any of that do you get involved in any of that, Daniel? I don't. Uh, James does a fantastic job on that, but we're always looking for people to get involved. So uh, if you do want to get involved, go to the blog, uh, reach out, look for James Kirk, uh, and you can get involved. Yeah, that's guest, guest posting on the... Yeah. yeah, we'll be doing more of that, I think, next year. Brilliant. Well, thanks so much. Obviously, it's kind of your couch, it's your event, <laughs> but, but thanks for joining us and telling us more anyway. Pleasure. Thank you, guys. Bye. If you enjoyed the video, please like it and share it with others. Source interview people from London's creative industry so you can learn from their experiences. To see more of our videos, subscribe to the channel now. And if there's someone you'd like to see interviewed, even yourself, then tweet us, put it in the comments or get in touch via email. Thanks again.